Hello and welcome to Play to Learn, our video series introducing you to MyViewboard. This episode is on the MyViewboard ecosystem. What do we mean when we say ecosystem? Well, we simply mean that MyViewboard apps can work well with other apps so that you're not tied into one suite of apps from a particular company. First up is Whiteboard, which as you might have guessed is a digital whiteboard for presenting your ideas and collaborating together whether that's for education or business. Here's everything you need to know to get started. Whiteboard is available for Windows and Android devices, and we also have a lightweight online version too, no downloads necessary. Right now I'm using Whiteboard for Windows in desktop mode, which means I have all my whiteboarding tools over the standard Windows operating system. So for example, I can draw with the pen over anything on Windows. Let's leave Whiteboard for a moment and sign in to the MyViewboard website. Welcome to the MyViewboard homepage. If you want to download any of our apps, just click here. Let's have a look at Whiteboard Online. This is accessible from a web browser. No downloads necessary. What about hybrid learning? Is there any way to share your Whiteboard in real time to remote students? Well, MyViewboard has you covered with another app called Classroom. This is available from a web browser, also no downloads necessary, and features a versatile digital canvas, interactive tools, and student management. One feature I find useful is the AI pen. It can guess what I'm drawing and suggest icons like this. If we click this icon in the bottom right, we get our dashboard. This is where the teacher can view and manage their students in the classroom session. We can see student status, create huddles for group work, manage the class, check if the students are staying focused, broadcast video and more. To join the session, students can either scan a QR code, type in a URL or go to myviewboard.com and click join classroom session. Just like a real classroom, students can simply raise their hand to get attention and ask a question. The teacher can see this and choose to either let them speak, edit the canvas, or even choose to put their hands down for now. Tools like Image Search will only return safe and appropriate content cleared for educational use. The students and the teacher can interact on the canvas in real time and collaborate. Our next topic is the companion app available for mobile devices. Use it to control whiteboard sessions via remote control, share files and participate in polls and quizzes. Display is another MyViewboard app. Use Display to wirelessly share your screen. Only the host device needs to download the Display app, which is available for Windows and Android. Simply enter the screen ID and secure passcode at myviewboard.com slash display to start sharing your screen. My Viewboard Record is, you guessed it, for recording your whiteboard session on Android. It's available as a standalone app that also handily integrates into Whiteboard. Simply download it from the Google Play Store and grant it the necessary permissions like this. And now we can choose the resolution and begin recording our session, which is saved locally. Live is a similar app, also available for Android, which allows us to live stream whiteboard sessions to YouTube, Facebook and other services. Manager is a service for IT admins of my viewboard entities. It's available as a web app and can be used to monitor devices send broadcasts to devices, schedule jobs such as updates or powering off, and view device usage reports. My Viewboard Originals include high quality backgrounds, games, and other content available for you to use in your presentations and lessons.
finally, Clips, our video assisted learning platform. All videos are high quality, educational, copyright cleared, and ad free. A great feature is the custom quizzes. Test your students' knowledge with quizzes embedded into videos. There's pre-made collections of videos for certain topics, which include lesson plans and activity guides following the common course standards. Thanks for watching and don't forget to check out our other videos if you haven't already.